In this video, we provide the solution to question number four for the practice exam number one for Math 1050. We're given three functions, f, g, and h right here, and we're asked to evaluate f minus g at negative one. So the first thing to note here is that since we're trying to compute f minus g, we actually don't need the function h whatsoever. So that's just a distractor to us. Uh, what does f minus g mean? It means we subtract the functions for which there's two options. Uh, we could subtract the, the algebraic formulas f and g and then evaluate at negative one. But f minus g at negative one is the same thing as f of negative one minus g of negative one. So if you prefer, you could evaluate the functions first, then subtract their evaluations, or we could just do it algebraically, the difference first. That's the approach I'm gonna take. Uh, so notice if we take f of x minus g of x, we're gonna end up with two x plus one, that's the function for f, and then subtract from that four x plus two. Do make sure that this negative sign is distributed onto both pieces. You're gonna get two x minus four x, which is a negative two x, and you're gonna get one minus two, which is a negative one there. Uh, so this is f minus g. So if we want to do f minus g evaluated at negative 1, we plug negative 1 into this value here, negative 2 times negative 1 minus 1. We're going to get positive 2 minus 1, and so we see that the value would be 1, hence the correct choice is b.